What's going on YouTube, it's What's the Hype back with another video, and in today's video I'm going to be talking about balaclavas, as I've seen them in a lot more fit pics on Instagram, as well as just people posting them more, and I thought I'd show you guys what they look like, where to find them, and I give all different types of range, so super cheap, everybody can afford them, all the way up to Raph Simmons, so hope you guys enjoy, make sure to drop a like on the video if you do, and subscribe to the channel if you'd like to see similar content, thank you guys for watching, let's get it. So the ones I've been mostly into lately are the knitted wool ones and you can mostly find these on places like Etsy is where I would recommend. So I showcased a few sellers that I thought they looked really cool. Uh, this guy I think the way he models them is kind of weird but I think all of the colors and designs with the stripes look really cool on his. So I would highly recommend you guys check out Etsy if you're interested in picking up a balaclava as well as this woman's balaclavas I thought were really cool. The patterns I haven't seen many like this with a big kind of crochet knits. I also thought this rainbow one was really cool, the colors look really nice and for 30 bucks you can't really beat it. Then looking at some of the cheaper options you can find, I think there's a lot of options you can find like for under 10, 20 bucks and this is a good example of one. I don't think these have much detail but if you want like the Kanye look where you could just kind of cut around it, you could get that same look with the red one. Target also offers a decent variety for 12 bucks and I thought they looked pretty good on the people who took pictures with them. They also have striped ones if you don't want it plain like all over monochrome one. And I thought the stripes, the colors on these were actually pretty cool. MoMA also makes a balaclava and I saw this first from Nitz on his Instagram. He had a fit pic with it, which I thought he styled it pretty nicely. And it's just pretty unique. If you look at the colors, it's clean. They go together and something that would definitely stand out. If you guys are looking for more of like a tech look on your balaclava, I'd recommend the one from Arteryx comes in at neutral colorways so you can wear this with a lot of different outfits as well as the Matthew Williams one with Nike I also think is pretty good and for the price I was actually surprised it's not too too expensive and it's definitely unique with the brim on the camo one. The next two have a pretty similar look, similar to a beanie, but the Carhartt one I thought was pretty nice in that Carhartt brown, as well as the ones from Stussy. I think it has nice minimal logos on it, which is cool because it won't stand out too much, but definitely just a clean everyday design. Someone I recently came across is Alexandria Masse, is I believe how you would pronounce that, and she has a really unique design. If you guys look at it, it's like the circles and they're connected almost, and it just looks really cool in my opinion. They retail at $400, but if you guys think about the hours it takes to put into this, as well as you're getting a one-on-one -on -one piece that nobody has, I think it kind of justifies the price. Some of the more popular expensive ones come from Raph Simmons, which I think they all look really nice, really cool colorways, and these have been popular as you can see Playboy Cardi, as well as you'll see ASAP Rocky wearing these. The colorways and the different types of materials all look really good on these, and I would say they are super expensive, but it is worth it if you guys have the money. I also really like the South 2 West 8 one from Supreme. Supreme has a ton of balaclavas that aren't too too expensive either. I think they have some really good colorways. I like the ones where it's usually more minimal branding. I used to own this Polar Tech one and it was super warm, but Supreme always has good options when it comes to balaclavas if you want more of a streetwear looking one. The New Balance ALD one also looks really really good in my opinion. I like the tan colorway and think they especially styled that one nicely. Hopefully this video helps you out. Maybe you learned about some options you didn't know about before. Let me know, are you guys feeling them or just not for you? Also, if you guys did enjoy it, drop a like and subscribe, as well as let me know in the comments what you'd like to see in the future, as I'm always trying to think of new ideas and it helps when I get some opinions from the people who watch. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.